In recent years, there's been a growing number of individuals who have allegedly traveled through time. All around the world, there appears to be a number of strange occurrences that seem to create a manipulation in both space and time. These strange occurrences have come to be known as different instances of time travel and time slips in our reality, that not only causes unexplainable phenomena to surface, but can change our very perspective on the nature of our world. A time traveller has just announced that in the not so distant future, a new species will emerge from within the Earth, saying that these creatures will appear after the ground opens up in America. Oddly enough, this is one of the first times that an alleged time traveller has come forward with this theory, and it led some to say that the theory might be rooted in reality, pointing out that you can't find people living in cave dwellings across the world. For example, in Australia in a town called Cooper Pedy, around half the population lives underground. Those who've been to the area detailed that these dwellings go underground, as well as being carved into the nearby mountains, and this led some to say that the idea of humans living underground is rooted somewhat in reality. The time traveller then went on to detail that in July of this year, America will experience the biggest earthquake of all time, with them naming it the Great Split. Again, this idea has been shared by researchers in the United States, with scientists saying that a huge earthquake is going to hit the southern San Andreas Fault, but revealed that we don't know when it's going to happen, but notes that it could be any time now. A fault line is basically a large crack in the Earth, with the San Andreas Fault Line being a strike-slip fault, this event occurs when two tectonic plates slide past each other. Experts in California have said that it's around 80 years overdue for the big one, which is the name that they've given to a massive earthquake that they said would devastate the area. The recent earthquake activity hasn't given scientists much hope either, with them noting that although the low tremors that hit Southern California back in June 2021 didn't do much damage, the big one would be an entirely different story, saying that the cost of damage could easily go to around 200 to 250 billion dollars, and that thousands of people could lose their life. The time traveller ended by saying that this event will greatly impact the United States, and will completely change the country. Interestingly, this isn't the only alleged time traveller that's come forward with their story. One time traveller who wishes to stay anonymous detailed what they saw in the future. They said that they worked for a government project that selected a few individuals to be part of a top secret mission. The man didn't go into detail about the mission, but said that during the process the candidates were kept in the dark in regards to what the mission was about, and didn't find out until the last minute that they were part of a group that would time travel. The only credentials he listed was that he was high up in the military, had dedicated his life to the services, didn't have family and didn't have any children, saying that this was one of the requirements needed in order to take part in the mission. The man detailed that energy never leaves the universe, and that once it's out there it can be seen if you have the correct machinery. The device that allowed him to time travel would lock onto these clusters of energy that were floating around in the universe, and in turn the machine would turn them into moving images. He also detailed that there was another machine that would allow you to travel forwards in time, or at least see events that would play out in the future. He said the following, Many time travel claims may be wrong because what I've seen on one timeline may not match up with what someone else has seen on another. There's countless possibilities that could happen to our universe in the future, and when we lock onto these cosmic energies, we are just seeing one possibility out of an infinite number of possibilities. End quote. The man detailed that our future doesn't look bright, or at least the timeline in which he saw doesn't look good for humanity. He detailed that mass famine will spread across the world in the next 100 years, and that freedom will be virtually non-existent. He details that it doesn't play out in the way that many people think it would, saying that there's not a horrible leader, 
but rather the vast majority of humans voluntarily give up their freedom without knowing. He said that doing basic things in the future will be tough for the majority of humanity. Also noting that the human population levels out at around 10 billion. He says that by 2150, 4 billion people will be very poor and will struggle to eat and drink. He said there will be an overruling one world government that will lay out plans to help these people live. But in doing so, the majority of their freedom will be given up because they can't afford to own anything. Although these stories are interesting and they make you think about the future, scientists have said that none of them are true. They're all made up and that there's no evidence that anyone has time travelled. Regardless, this hasn't stopped people from coming forward with their stories of time travel. So what do you make of these time travel stories? And what do you think will happen in the future? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.